How's it going everybody and welcome back to a brand new video. Now in this video I'm going to be showing you guys, well I'm not going to be showing you guys actually fully, I'm going to be sort of telling you guys how you can do this so much cheaper than it already has to be. The Payette, the, um, the the Douglas Costa and the Mario Gasper cards can be done so much cheaper than what they are now and now at the minute you're looking for about 400k to complete the Payette, uh, about Two, 300k to complete the Costa and about near enough 100k to complete the Mario Gaspar. Now, these are going to be so much cheaper very, very soon. Now, as you guys already know, um, the next weekend, not this weekend, next weekend, um, we are going to have a an upgrade weekend where all the Scream cards, now if you don't know what the Scream cards are, like, I don't know how you don't know because they've been literally everywhere. These Scream cards next weekend are going to have an incredible upgrade, like there's going to be a 90 rated Pantillamon and 90 rated Fellaini. They're going to have incredible upgrades for a weekend and one weekend only. Um, and during that weekend, I believe their prices are going to rock it up completely. They're going to shoot up massively. Um, to the point where like the night raid Pantelemon at the minute is going for like 70k, it will go up to like 120k. Mainly because I think people are going to buy these cards to help them with the weekend league and get better rewards in the weekend league. As soon as that weekend's over, the prices of all these cards are going to completely plummet. They're going to plummet massively and that is when you should pick these cards up to do the challenges, to get the Payette, to get the um, Costa, to get the Gaspar. Um, and I mean, I think to do all three, Probably going to cost you about seven hundred thousand coins. I reckon in a week, literally about a week and a week and a bit, maybe ten days, it'll cost you around five hundred k to complete them all, four hundred k to complete them all, and that already seems like a lot. But I would quite happily pay two three hundred k to complete the Payette one. Like definitely, I'd pay two three hundred k to complete the Payette one without a shadow of a doubt. And I'd definitely pay like a hundred and fifty k or hundred k or maybe yeah maybe about a hundred k, hundred and fifty k. I'd complete the gas. Uh, the Costa one and like 40k to complete the gas bar one. Like I'd pay that much. Let me know in the, in the comments down below if you'd pay that much. But at the minute, they are so expensive that it's just not worth doing. So I definitely recommend waiting until roughly like the last day that these be out. These are out for 12 days in a minute, and currently it's a Saturday, so they'll be out for 11 days on the Sunday. So a week on the Sunday, they'll be out for four more days. They go out on the Wednesday, so I'd say doing it on Monday or Tuesday would be the best option because that's when their prices are going to rocket downwards because of these upgrades are now going to be out of packs or not the, not out of packs, but the upgrades are now going to be over. So I definitely recommend, boys, if you guys have any of these cards, to keep on keep hold of them, sell them at the weekend, and then buy them back after the weekend and do the, the squad build challenges then. And also, I just want to quickly say before the end of the video is, um, we're so close to 9,000 subscribers, so thank you all for that. Honestly, it means a hell of a lot to be that close to 9,000 subscribers. Considering we hit 8K less than three weeks ago, it is mind-blowing. The fact that we've gained like a 1,000 subscribers in like 18, 19 days. It's it's crazy. And just thank you all for that. Honestly, I can't, I couldn't have done it without you guys and your support. So thank you all for that. And also, let me know down below. Um, at the minute, this is my current squad. I didn't even qualify for the weekend league because I'm a shit cunt. Um, but let me know down below price ranges for squad builders. And I'll do a squad builder on the price range you guys recommend for me because I kind of want to implement a sort of um, a way to, to to help you guys out with, with squad builders uh, and the prices that you guys really want. So let me know down below if you want that and let me know if you want a squad build for that as well. Thank you for watching this video boys. Hopefully it helped you guys out. It's been hey, you guys are fantastic and I'll see you later.